Data fees from the exchange have recently changed. The good news is you have a couple of different options. Let's take a look. On the left-hand side, we have a trading ladder of the E-mini S&P with a depth of market view 10 ticks deep. That's data that contains bids 10 ticks below the market price on the blue side and offers 10 ticks above the market on the right side. That's 10 ticks deep. And those data fees are $10 per month per exchange up to three exchanges. The fourth exchange is bundled for free. So a total could be $30 per month. On the right-hand side is the top of book. Top of book data just has the best bid. Top of book data has the best bid in the blue and the best offer on the right. One tick deep, that's top of book. This data is a dollar per month per exchange for all four exchanges. Now, if you're trading from the dome, you have either option available to you. If you're trading just from the charts, the web-based charts, let's take a look, then there's no depth of market and you only need the top of book. Now, what's an exchange? Well, as an example, CME Group, if you're trading E-mini S&Ps, you'd be trading a CME market. That would be a dollar a month. If you also would like to trade crude oil, that would be NYMEX. That would be another dollar a month. If you wanted gold, COMEX, that would be another dollar a month. So that's how they break up the exchanges is per product. And there's four sub exchanges for the CME group. That's why there's a difference. So depending on what you're trading, it could add up. And $30 a month is, just, you know, is, is, is it nothing? But compared to, you know, $4 a month, well, that's a better deal. Especially if you're just trading from our device agnostic uh, uh, trading platform here, the Infinity AT charts. If you would like to change your plan, either way, to the top of book or to the depth of market, all you need to do is log into your customer portal. And you do that by going to Infinity Futures homepage or any page of Infinity Futures and clicking on the upper button that says Clients. At the top of the menu, it says Clients. I'm gonna go ahead and click on that. It'll open up a new page. It's the Transact Portal. The Transact Portal then has a login button where you log in with your username and password. And you can simply go to the data fee section and change your plan to whatever you'd like. Hope that helps.